Treat him as a psychologist. <laughs> I thought it was far too intelligent to have come from a critic. And it goes on to say, the creative process that finds the clearest expression in art is irrational. It will always succeed our attempts at comprehension. Erotics are responsible for most of the great masterpieces in life. We appreciate music, painting, literature. But we have no idea how many sleepless nights, how much nervous laughter, hives, asthma, attacks of epilepsy they cause their creators. Not to mention the fear of death, which is worse than all the rest. There are two freedoms occupying the same physical space. You paint in order to conjure up the wounded Frida. You were a child. You knew you had to protect one of your demons. That's why you rid yourself of the wounded Frida. Papa warned the ego about me. Frida has two demons inside. Frida. Viva Frida. Most intelligent of my daughters, the one most like me. Diego loves me. Ever since I met him, we combined hunger with the desire to eat. <laughs> I fought in every possible way to be the center of attention, not to be lost in the shadow of his fame, and to be original and amusing, and not to be left alone. Are you happy with him? I wonder why Papa agreed to let me marry Diego. <laughs> you know, in the beginning, he and Mama used to complain because he was fat and old and a communist. <laughs> they said he looked like 